Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So, it is oh, about mid-May. Just want to give you an update on my community garden plot. Let's walk in here. You'll see the sun chokes right here. Here are the sun chokes. They're getting really big, really fast. So the chipmunks didn't get to them this year, so they all came back and they're very lush and big. Right here is the dill, the volunteers that came back from the seeds. Looking nice and pretty. Look how nice and pretty it is there. It's beautiful, lush. My okra came up right there, one of them. And then, you'll see, this other okra came up. These are supposed to be really long pods that uh, are tender at a long length. So we'll see about that. So my cucumber looking good. They're all taking really well. Here's my zucchini. And then here's my yellow squash looking good. Here's this one cloudy hybrid tomato plant. It's looking kind of rough, but it's making it. I don't know what's going on over here, but see these bottom leaves died off and uh, it's just not looking very good. But uh, see what happens with this one. Not really sure what's going on. Move over here to the tomato bed. You see they're all growing well. These are three cherry tomatoes. And this is a stupus right here. It's looking very good. Come over here. See the asparagus. And I'll put off more baby asparagus down here. The leeks are growing. Looking good. Being established. It's my eggplants. And this one's getting attacked by flea beetles, it looks like. You can see all the little holes. Those are a pain. To figure out how to treat those. Here's all my strawberries looking really good. Getting established. Looking really nice. It's my pepper bed. A mix of sweet and hot peppers. Doing okay. I already have some peppers on these here. I don't know what this one is. Uh, what is this pepper here? Banana pepper. So yeah, we got some banana peppers growing. This looks good. And this is a lively Italian sweet pepper. Some right there. Looking good. And here's another tomato plant I have in that bed there. Here is the valerian root. All those flowers. And it has a nice scent to it too. It's really, it smells really nice. Sweet scent. Probably gonna have to cut it back because it's, it's getting uh, in with my leeks I had planted here on the edge. So I'll cut it back after the flowers. I'm sure it'll be fine. That's doing well. And here's all my onions looking good. Really getting established. These are red onions. Long day. Looking really nice. Really, really nice. My other tomato bed, these are all heirloom tomatoes. Getting some fruit on them. Looking really good. Very pleased. Move over to the garlic and the walking onions. There's some leeks in here too, but here's the walking onions. Looking good, getting all their little bulbets up top here. It's an interesting plant. Here's the leek that overwintered with its giant flower that for some reason just flipped over. I'm not sure what's going on with that. Here's the garlic. I think it's looking pretty good. See the scapes are starting to come on. When these get bigger, I'll harvest them and be able to eat them. So, but yeah, there's some scapes here. Looking pretty good. Some of these stems are pretty thick, so I'm assuming the garlic is going to be pretty big under there, too. And then, here is the last bed of my peppers. These are all hot peppers, and I believe they're all super hot here. They're doing pretty well. It's kind of yellow. I don't know why. Sometimes the plants are just like that with a yellow leaf. I'm not really sure. Hopefully it's not getting attacked by insects. Might be. There's something under there. It looks like aphids again. I'm going to have to treat these. Never-ending battle. Um, and here's the last tomato plant. This is Cherokee purple, so it's looking good. And I pruned off a lot of suckers today. Need some maintenance. So overall, everything's looking pretty good. One last view of the whole thing. Looking good. Alright. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. And I'll see you in my next video.